back with another video. Krishan is done. Finito, finish, kaput. Let's get into it. Before we get into it, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified of my videos, and go ahead and share it if you like. So you know, Kashan got a whole lot going on. Cops came over to the house, people were saying it was a setup, there was all kind of stuff going on. So they came to the house, well, not her house, Blue's house, but they came over there. So I was thinking that, you know, old dude, he don't send them over there because he tired of them. Wag 100, said he was going to have them put out there, so I figured that's what it was. They were saying it was the neighbors. They were saying it was all kind of people that had something to say. So now, y'all know that whole thing with Tamar's friend, where Kashawn allegedly hit him in the mouth and broke his tooth, cracked his tooth, did something. Now, it's actually a lawsuit waiting to happen. It's, it's, it's in full effect. Like, she's in trouble. Now, the thing is, are they going to settle out of court? That might be her best bet, because if she had to go to court, all these warrants and stuff she got going on, where this baby gonna go? Where this child gonna go? Cause Blueface locked up and her getting locked up too. I don't know how much time she gonna get, but they trying to claim that he's getting out soon and they saying no, he's gonna do a lot of time. This right here is gonna be crazy. That poor baby. She knows she got warrants like, why would you do this stuff? This alleged, but why would you do this? And the whole thing that like made everybody mad, like Tamar, stop, stop being like that. You knew how this girl was. You put in this situation and then you act like you didn't want to say nothing when everybody's acting like what was going on. If she really did this to this dude, why didn't you say something in the beginning? Why did you try to run all around the whole situation? It made it look like a whole setup. Like they didn't like her from the beginning. You see how Tony was act acting when she came in there for prayer and how everybody was looking at her and stuff. They didn't want her in in the first place. You did this stuff for clout. You wanted this clout. Because you know, that's what Kashawn do. She bring the clout. That's why a lot of people be wanting around for the clout. She bring the clout. And that's what you got. Like your soon to be, well, soon to be husband, your fiance, he played you. And basically was saying she wants clout and how her shows weren't selling out and all that kind of stuff. So basically you wanted her for clout. And it didn't go out the way you wanted to go. And dude done allegedly got hit in the mouth. So now you're responsible for that because you had her there and you had him there. So you're responsible for it. Who they gonna come after you? So now all of a sudden you wanna say something, you wanna, oh, oh I'm so sorry, this and that. No, you brought her here for clout just like everybody else do. And your fiance, yeah, he called you out when he was dealing with old girl. Like, yeah. So that showed what type of person you are. So what y'all think about that? Crazy, right? And so, Kashan is on live with a whole different situation. She's on there crying, and everybody's like, man, I don't believe it. So, she just want to get on there and show some tears so people feel bad for her and all this kind of stuff. She just got to be making up something to talk about and cry about so people can feel bad for her. But anyway, y'all tell me what y'all think about it after y'all watch this live of her crying and going through her whole situation. Okay. Let me turn my comments off. I was on my explore page. Um, my heart go out. Ooh, my heart just go out to anybody that lost somebody. For real, like, I feel like over the years, a lot of people lost a lot of people. It's so much pain there. And I, I don't even be, like, trying to cry for real when I be watching these videos, but I be seeing so much pain in the video. I be like, oh my God. Like, you know, I never witnessed somebody close to me that died. But my heart goes out for Jesus. Let me 
me get up out of here. Can't <coughs> Like my heart goes out to the people that lost people. Um, it's twenty twenty four. Um, I feel like this is probably one of the most successful years for a lot of people, and they can't enjoy anything or their accomplishments. Because somebody either lost a sister, a brother, a dad, and my pain, like, to, like, witness your pain, like, on my phone, be, like, so, like, it be like it touches me like that's how bad like that pain is I don't know I never would witnessed it but my heart go for anybody that lost him because it's it's just like whoa like you know like at this point where Jesus at like <laughs> like, like you feel me like <laughs> Everybody leaving this shit. Like, where Jesus at? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is when God come back. So we, uh, <laughs> you feel me? But I genuinely, uh, <sighs> that was so hard to watch. Like, I don't even know what the fuck. Like, my TikTok, not my TikTok, my, um, my explorers start giving me, like, the emotion, like, you know, the motivation was. Speaking and shit, and then I just went to like random people talking about the losses. I'm just like, what is this? She's like crying, like that shit is like so bad. So I'm just very thankful. I woke up and I had my son. He healthy. We wake up every day. And it's just a blessing and enjoy whoever, that person we love as a gift, um, as a, because they're not promised. So it's like all 2024, I'm just watching how I'm going to speak to people. Like even people I don't like, that don't like me, that's out to get me, talk bad about me, bash me. God bless your heart. Because it's like. We're just not promised. To be here. Popping it. To each other. Beefing or whatever. Like. I, just, I was just like. Oh my God. And then. Not like that. They. um, uh, It's like this one video. That put up like. A whole rack of influencers, models, actors, like people that we look up to, basically, athletes, rappers, whoever, died, right? Like they had a big, big impact and they just died. That shit is like unbearable. Like, I'm just like, damn. And then, what is, what's up with the, um, like, what's up with the kids? Like, this, like, what state or country is that when, um, it's a video and it's, like, white stuff all over the child or it's blood, they're either not breathing. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, what the fuck is going on with the economy at this point? Like, what's going on with the world? Like. Um, I don't know what state, country, but it's like common that they're dying and it's like they're trying to build awareness. Like, what is that? Like, what is that? Like, you know, like, and then I didn't look too deep in it because I'm like, and, and I think a lot of us don't look into it because we're just scared to know the truth and scared to face whatever, but it's like, why is everybody's dying? Like, why? Why is everybody dying? Like, I know it's like time for people to go, but 
Are you listening? There is children. There is children dying. Remember that story in the Bible when uh, they was killing the first boy, born sons or something? Uh, basically, what I'm trying to say is, um, I don't know. I got emotional. I seen all this death on my Explore page about kids dying. Um, this, this girl leaves her, her mom. It's just like, what the fuck? Like, I guess it's like a grieving world where you learn how to cope with those. You talk to people that's relate into Because I, I, I personally can't relate to um, somebody who's dying close to me. Um, but... You know, when, God forbid, or whenever that occur, like, I, I don't know. I, I think I see myself probably, like, I don't know. Like, it's like a stain that you wear forever. Like, what the fuck? Like, I don't know. It's, all I got to say is, where Jesus at? <laughs> like for real not like like where is where is he at when it's happening no I'm not saying that I'm saying when do he come back to earth and save us all like when do he come back and just take us out of our misery like all right y'all so what y'all think y'all think the whole Tamar friend thing is going down she gonna settle out of court that might be her best bet she better get them coins together get them coins together real quick not saying she ain't got no money but i'm just saying it'd be smart for her to get those coins together and get her lawyer and just settle this stuff out of court because you go to court that that <laughs> that might not be good you got warrants already you better be like oh i'm gonna settle this out of court what you want get your teeth brand new brand new teeth what what, what else do you want keep that out of court because you go to court it's gonna be a big problem. They're gonna be coming coming for other stuff. Like you got them other warrants and stuff like that. It ain't gonna be too pretty, so you better settle out. Now when it comes to this crying situation and all of that, what y'all think? Y'all feel like she just brought that up or she's really sad. I think she's sad, but I think sometimes she used certain things to bring on attention or make people like her again because she lost a lot, a lot of followers. She really did. But like I can like I say all the time. You can't help but feel bad for her. I know she done this and she put it on herself, but I feel bad for a lot of people. Their mental ain't right. They got something going on. I feel bad for them. I feel bad for the situation. I mainly feel bad for her. Well, should I say her child? I feel really bad for the child. That's who I really feel bad for because if she go off to jail and that daddy in jail, who going to take care of her? Carlissa going to have that baby or that grandpa. But hey, yeah, you got to make sure your child is good no matter what. You got a child. That day you found like you was pregnant, you was having a child. Everything should have been straight after then. No problems whatsoever. Shouldn't have got in no more trouble, no more nothing. Should have been such an angel. You got to think about that child. But anyway, y'all comment down below. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe to Banger Plate Gang. Subscribe to Trish World. Make sure you check me out on social media. Check out my shop. Check out my IGT page. Shout out with your girl. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, be blessed.